lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have uh, rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary. But the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing round the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. The Emirates Stadium in all its glorious modernity, this symbol of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction, and hopefully, the style of contest. And that gets things running. That's Bukhatari. Obama Yang. Bearin delivers, and it's hoisted clear. Timely intervention. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. He's pinged one through here. He's got away. Firmino, shot a goal! Goal! All over in seconds. That's what they can do to you. That's just brilliant counter-attacking football, and as soon as possession was theirs, it triggered a move of devastating speed that was just too hot to handle. I doubt very much that this was in the script. Ramsey. Back into the middle. Aubameyang is demanding it out wide. It's loose. Who's getting there? That will be a corner. Gomez knocks it away. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. He's got the ball, he's got the space. Chance to... Has a hit! Forward it goes. He's brushed off the ball there. Strong challenge, but well within the laws. And the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. It's a loose ball. Look at... It's Mkhitarya! <laughs> it's an outwit the keeper, but... Made off target. 
Mkhitaryan might just be regretting what was probably the toughest of his options. Firmino. Keita plays it out to the wing. Surely he scores! Defending was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. And it's Mkhitaryan. Obama Yang. Obama Yang. It's one! And the ball's come loose! It's being played forward. Liverpool have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Mukatarian. Looking to go deep. And it's hoisted clear. It's a brilliant interception. Mohamed Salah. Mustafi. Mkhitaryan. Here it comes. Obama Yang. Mkhitaryan. Obama Yang. Obama Yang hits it. And the follow up. And he's there to make a great save. Mkhitaryan sparked a tremendous stop there. And I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. to bear in, plays it forward. And it's Hector Bearin, Mukatarian. Tries to get it forward quickly. Mukatarian really struggling to influence the game. Ah, uh, he needs a minder, and one of his teammates should be picking up on that and quickly. Firmino, Milner, it's Aubameyang, Aubameyang, Trout calling for him to shoot, oh sweet feet, boots to safety, aimed long and direct, it will be. Pops it into the area. Salah. Mane. Mustafi goes looking. Mkhitaryan. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Mkhitaryan. Turns and goes. Has a he scores! Looks offside, I think. Yep, the flag is up. Is the light very short-lived? The referee's assistant did have his flag up. It might have been close, but it was correct. Disappointment and relief on either side. Nothing doing. Robertson, Hector Bearin gives chase. And now they can launch a counter. Oh, real big chance! And that'll be the final action of the first half. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but well, it still had its moments.
but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half time because in truth they've not really been at it so far. And if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. And the second half gets on the way. Arsenal don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in the second half. They can't hold back though. That is terrific skill. Gomez plays it forward. Xhaka is the guilty party there. he wanted Firmino really got caught in a trap there and he just couldn't get out forward it goes and it's Salah Mohamed Salah is alert to the possibilities but in the end it's fruitless Ramsey tries to get it forward Mkhitaryan and out to safety strength too strong for his opponent Wijnaldum plays it forward now it's Roberto Firmino Keita that's the throw Deflected over the goal line for a corner. Can he put it away? It's bounced out. Same again, same outcome. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but they've got to make it count. this the right way this isn't the time to talk about risks now Jim is it they just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break just has to be done goes for goal he scored two to the good they have breathing space Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Liverpool get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. He's gone for it! He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage.
Nacho Monreal delivers. Oh, that's over here. Firmino pushes to get on the end of it. This defence is, is weary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Milner goes up and over. Milner needed to come up with a better ball. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Hector Behrin plays it over to the other flank. Now it's Iwobi. This ball, who's going to get there? And Dyke wants one to read it and intercepts. Well, decisiveness has deserted them, Peter. They need precision, and it's sadly absent. Milner takes the long option. Tries a header! Oh, no, he's got that completely wrong. It's Mane. Mustafi cuts it out. Granit Xhaka. And it's Iwobi. Aubameyang gets into some space. And the finish! Arsenal are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. This is threatening to become a really good game. Well, they've given themselves a chance here, but now it's a case of getting the balance right between attack and defence, and that's not easy. Well played, he saw that coming. Aubameyang. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Mane, he's left his man. Socrates goes Liverpool looking. probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. That's Obamia. And that will be the final act. Super game. It might have tipped in either direction. Tiny margins, but they just lost it. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Well, the surprise for me was seeing a team look so feeble in what is usually a strongly protected area. But the centre of their defence looked open and very, very unsafe. I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim and a very good afternoon to you.